Kazan Aircraft Plant is in the final stages of completing the necessary preparations for the beginning of flight tests on the Tupolev Tu-214 RA-64509 Flying Laboratory for Import Substituted Systems. Konstantin Timofev, the Managing Director of Tupolev JSC and the first Deputy Director General of United Aircraft Corporation, mentioned this on his Telegram channel. The top manager noted in the results of the week, Completion of construction and equipping of new production sites of Gorbunov Aircraft Plant in Kazan, as well as commissioning of a number of facilities, is planned by the end of the year. This will make it possible to significantly increase the rate of aircraft production. I held a meeting of the staff on the flying laboratory. In the near future, its flight will take place after the complete replacement of imported components. The first flight of the aircraft with the flight number RA-64509 took place in November 2006. The aircraft was operated by Transaero Airlines from April 2007 to October 2015. This TU-214 was repainted in the United Aircraft Corporation corporate livery at the 407th Civil Aviation Plant in Minsk on the 14th of June 2024, following several years of storage and restoration of airworthiness. As per Tatar Inform, according to the orders of the Russian Ministry of Industry and Trade No. 663 of 31st of March 2015, the TU-214 aircraft was required to replace over 240 sections of onboard equipment components with Russian ones. It covered the systems of collision warning in the air and dangerous proximity to the Earth, media radar, radio stations, satellite and inertial navigation equipment, units of radio navigation equipment, drive generators, fuel and hydraulic pumps and pumping stations, various sensors, relays, electrical connectors, contactors, filters, and elements of household and rescue equipment. The TU-214 was shown to be 87% composed of domestically procured component parts in the summer of 2023. Kazan Aircraft Plant and Tupolev are required to replace all imported components in the TU-214 design with Russian ones by the end of 2024 and obtain approval for them to be included in the type certificate. It is anticipated that the TU-214LL will evaluate the Russian inertial navigation system, meteorological radar station, early warning system of ground proximity, and rescue equipment. In the past, these systems were supplied by foreign companies. Konstantin Timofev had previously said that the mechanical processing center at Kazan Aircraft Plant is 52% completed. The glazing of the building, the pouring of the first floor floor slab, the installation of engineering communications, and the arrangement of foundations for machine tools are currently underway. The thermal circuit of the building will be closed by the end of the year, and the installation of technological and storage equipment as well as the interior finish, will commence. The facility's construction necessitates the participation of 144 individuals and 23 units of specialized equipment. The construction of the new shop is being conducted as part of the Complex Aviation Industry Development Program. The shop is designed to accommodate over 120 machining machines, which will guarantee the production of 20 T U214 aircraft annually. The managing director of Tupolev also disclosed that the company intends to establish three new logistics centers in Kazan Aircraft Plant by the end of 2025, with a combined area of approximately 90,000 meters square. The pile field is being prepared, networks are being relocated, and the old building has been dismantled for the construction of the first structure, according to him. Dismantling operations are currently underway in preparation for the construction of the second and third structures. The initial two facilities are anticipated to be finished in the summer of 2025, while the third is scheduled for the autumn. The Kazan Aircraft Plant will build and rebuild 24 facilities as part of the extensive modernization initiative. Nine of these facilities have already been operational. In order to commence serial production of 20 TU-214 civil airliners annually in 2028, the construction works must be finalized by the end of 2026. Now, do you think this test laboratory is testing virtually the entire range of Russian products or anything critical is still needed to be tested in the future? Let us know in the comments.
Please like and share our videos and subscribe to our channel. Please also take membership in our channel to encourage us.